and here we go, the first opening contest for WrestleBration 3. Mark Sanders takes on Big Bad Albert. Mike Milky Belt will have his hands full, but remember Mike Milky Belt will also have a lot on his mind as later on he may be fired or the Sheik may lose his hair and uh, the test of strength may or may not go down. Well, as you mentioned, Lance, we will see just how well Milky is able to concentrate here. Well, the excitement is palpable here in the Thunderdome and this is the biggest crowd we've ever had. It certainly is, Lance, and there is a buzz in the air like we've already mentioned. And test of strength. Here we go. Big Bad Albert forcing Mark Sanders into the bridge, holding him down. Oh, the shoulders were down. Well, keep the shoulders off the mat. Point there by the referee, Milky Bell as well. Oh, nice kip up there by Mark Sanders. Does he have the strength to reverse? Decided not to. Do. For the arm ringer. Smartly, I believe, decided not to do a test of strength again. Big Bad Albert there again. And the headlock applied to Big Bad Albert. And it doesn't matter how big you are, if you control the head, you control the body. Nice shoulder tackle, but does not take Big Bad Albert down, Will. Well, it certainly doesn't. A guy this size will not go down that easily. Max Sanders will have to find something else. So nice, we get to see it twice, but Big Bad Albert still on his feet. Absolutely no problem from Max Sanders. Looks the clothesline. Sanders off the rope. Whoa! Oh! Oh! Spinning heel kick. You do not expect to see that from a guy the size of Big Bad Albert. Power slam! That's what you expect to see from Big Bad Albert. And Mark Sanders was driven into the mat. Whoa, 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 here they come! And they're whoa. outside in front of us, and oh my god! I'm glad we were in on that one. I've got a funny feeling we should move this table back. I think we should be sat right in the car park, lads. What a big clothesline there by Big Bad Albert, putting it all on the line here in the Thunderdome. Uh, what, what can there be left? Whoa, 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 whoa. look at Albert. What What's is he thinking here? Perched and ready, off the apron. Oh! Oh! Crashes and burns to the outside, and Mark Sanders is in the ring, and the 10 count should start. Well, the fact is, Mark Sanders had to move out of that one, otherwise we would have been scraping Sanders from the floor here in the Thunderdome. Well, Big Bad Albert going for some sort of sunset plancher from the uh, apron, but instead crashes and burns to the outside, and now he has to answer Mike Milky Bell's 10 count. Mark Sanders taking his time, having a breather. A wise decision from a, a very uh, experienced wrestler. Forearm to the back of the head. Big Bad Albert, just the way he throws himself around is unbelievable. I mean, the guy is literally a tank with a Ferrari engine. And Sanders has whipped into the ropes, a full head of steam, and Albert oh! crashes, and again, not to be. Sanders had to move out of the way of that one. Alexander smashes and then the forearm shot again to Albert, trying to cut the big man down. And again, we've got a five count to work with. We mentioned it before, Lance. Doesn't matter how big you are, if you're on the floor, it makes no difference. Well, the, Max Sanders is, of course, a ring veteran. I've alluded to earlier that he does teach pro wrestling in Sheffield. Oh! Nice drop kick there by Sanders into the face of Albert. And Albert, for the first time really, decided to look worse for wear. Max Sanders not popular here in the Thunderdome. Certainly not, but he doesn't seem to care. Remember, Sheffield has done good, some good things for us, providing us with uh, steel. Using those uh, laces on the boots to rake the eyes of Albert. And Albert now backed into the corner. And Sanders really just forcing that boot into the face of Albert. This is what he's got to do. He's got to keep the air. Keep Albert from getting the air back into those lungs. They're a big set of lungs and they take a lot of air to fill them. That's very true. What a 
Mark Sanders got in mind here. Whoa! Forcing the shoulders into the chest of Albert. Once again, like we said, just pushing the air out of Albert. Oh! The first plate of chops have been served in the Thunderdome. Oh, and again. Wait a second. Wait a second. Oh, the big man. Whoa, ducks. And now. Oh! That echoed around the Thunderdome. And Big Bad Albert. Oh, he wants everybody to be quiet. Oh! oh! Jesus oh. Christ! I actually felt that myself. The Judder after the chop. Oh, quite again in the oh. Thunderdome. That breaks the ice and Sanders is out of the corner. But you've got to believe that after those chops, he is somewhat worse for wear. To the second rope. Sanders off the rope now. Close oh. line. And down goes Big Bad Albert. Cover inside leg hook. Oh, that was great. I thought that could have been it with that big close line from the, from the rope there, lads. Sanders in control right now. Yeah. This match has been back and forth. And what a way to kick off wrestle operation with these two guys. What well, Sanders got planned? Ready for that suplex? Does he have the momentum to oh. take him over? And yes, he does. That is impressive being able to get a guy the size of Alpha over for a suplex. It's all about the momentum. Oh, elbow drop delivered to the the small of the back cover two oh, and Albert kicks out but it was a very very was, he only barely got that shoulder up if you notice Lance Albert doing all he can to get the people in the, the Thunderdome here behind him and Albert working on the big man but not to be once again it breaks the eyes by Sanders like you, like you mentioned Lance he is a veteran Going for here. Oh, using the rope for momentum. And uh, Big Bad Albert just hung up there. Sanders using the rope. The referee Milky Bell not seeing that. The referee will be aware that they are close to the ropes, and Mike Milky Bell, this is not his first buffet. by Mark Sanders there Love holding on to the rope when the referee goes to have a look he moves his hand but oh, this time he's caught this time he got caught in, in the Whoa! Whoa! hip toss and Albert breaks free while Sanders was distracted with Milky Bell there big, big close line. line Albert trying to build up some steam now build up that momentum Albert going for a suplex of his own. Look at the strength of Big Bat. Albert manages to get Sanders over, but only just remember Sanders himself is a big man. And don't forget, Albert has taken a lot of punishment in this match. Sanders manages to kick out. More of a brain buster than a suplex. Very true, lads. Oh, the splash misses, and Albert, that mistake may have cost him. Well, you've got to believe, Lance, that if Albert had connected with that big splash, this match would be well and truly over. And now. Leg drop. This could be it. Two. And again, Albert manages to kick out before the three count. Albert not endearing himself here in the Thunderdome for these fans. Big Bad Albert has a following, but the guys here in the Thunderdome have no respect for Mark Sanders, and maybe that's to do with his geographical location of Sheffield. But now, Big Elbow misses, and Albert manages to break free just in the nick of time. Now Big Bad Albert once again tries to get those fans behind him. 
One of these guys needs to answer the 10 count, otherwise this match will end up in a double disqualification. But you've got to believe that whoever gets to their feet first will have an advantage, lads. Well, Albert uses the ropes oh. to get up, but again, a drilling clothesline, and Sanders is going down. Well, if you think about those clotheslines coming from Albert, it's a completely different story to receiving a clothesline from any normal man. Stiff right hands by Albert, but now a whiff into the corner now. Albert building up a head of steam. Will it work this time? Big splash, and again, oh, whoa, time, put Albert. some brakes on. Oh, here he goes. Here it oh, comes, splash oh. into the corner, and that has got to be all she's wrote. What's Albert got in mind here? Oh! Samoan drop in the center of the ring, perfect position. Can Albert get the cover? Can he take advantage of that high impact move there? Oh, Albert's got other plans on his mind. He's the top rope. He's not going to get that moonsault again. I think is he going. I think we know what he's going for here. I think he's thinking big splash. Well, a big splash on the second rope would end this match. I'm sure of that. Wrestlebration three size splash coming up. Oh! 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 That cover at three. That's it. And the fans are going to go home happy because Albert is victorious.